One of our very favorite things to do is get buck wild in the beauty department of our favorite drugstore. And today was no exception. My basket was full and it seemed all the colors were so good. I mean lip color, nail color, even a little snakeskin peely nail. It was all good and we just loaded it up until we realized we're broke. Yeah, we're on a budget. And we each had $15 to spend each. That's it. But given our $15, this is the face I got. I think you look fabulous, Mary. And I think you look fabulous as well, Miss Leah. Well, thank you so much. Well, we're so excited to show mm -hmm. you guys just how we got the look on a budget. So there are a few things that I absolutely cannot live without in my beauty regimen, and one of them is bronzer. I like to look like I just kind of got back from a tropical vacation, so I did not skimp on the bronzer. I picked up Rimmel London in Sun Kissed for $5.69. Eyebrows are extremely important, especially for me because I'm fair skinned and my eyebrows are not all that bold. Definitely add the eyebrow pencil. I gotta have a little color on my eyebrows, otherwise I look dead. So, for 99 cents, Wet n Wild has a really, really great little eyebrow pencil and I had to pick that up as well. Wet n Wild also makes a really great little eyeshadow compact that's $2.99 and it's great because it comes with three colors. One for the brow bone, one for the eyelid, and one for the crease. So you literally can't get this wrong. Luckily for Mary and I, NYC was having a sale on some of their mascara, and so I picked up the Showtime Volumizing Mascara, which was 40% off of $3.99. Mascara is so important. I don't care what I have on my face or don't have on my face. The moment I leave the house, I make sure I have on some good mascara, especially if I don't have any falsies on. Mascara makes your eyes pop don't leave home without it. One of Mary and I's beauty secrets is Wet n Wild lipstick. It's 99 cents and I don't care if I had $100 to spend on cosmetics, I would probably still buy this 99 cent lipstick. Mine was 514A, which is a really great color. It's bright and red, you can't go wrong with it. It goes on great, it lasts, and the great thing about this is I can also use it on the apples of my cheeks, which just gives a nice little rosy, blush color right on top of my bronzer. First up at the drugstore, I had to pick a bronzer. Now, bronzer is a girl's best friend. Everybody likes to be a little bit more tan, and I am absolutely no exception to that rule. So the first thing I do when I'm applying bronzer is I put a lot on my brush, and then I take the plastic part of it, and I kind of take some of it off so that your first brush on your face isn't intense, bright brown orange that you're then trying to like, move around so it keeps it kind of a light dewy finish. So I do that and I do a little three. And then I take a little extra and I go right here and here and it just kind of defines you and gives you a little extra cheekbone, which I like a lot. Now with my eyelash curler, I always count to 10 or I count back from 10. And I kind of give it like a little pump, 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 pump while I do it because it just kind of gives my eyelashes that extra little bit. And then boom, I have this curl. So when I apply my mascara, it's like my eyes are the real focus. Next up, I got some Wet n Wild eyeliner. Now, liquid eyeliner is my go-to always. I just, I'm a big fan of the cat eye. I think it's just a classic, fabulous look. So that's what I did here, my little cat eye. And I really am a big fan of mascaras that separate the lashes because I like to take the tip and kind of separate them a little bit and then I go horizontal and I give it a little kind of bump near the base of my eyelash and then I kind of pull it out again and then hit the top so that I'm getting all of it to give a nice kind of widespread eyelash look and then my eyes are really the focus. A lot of people try and pump their mascara to give them extra I guess bulk or something but do not do this. It actually puts oxygen inside the tube and it dries out your mascara. Now last but certainly not least, this little Wet n Wild lip color. Now this is my secret. I have people coming up to me asking me if it is Chanel, ask me all kinds of crazy things, who makes it. I've converted Leah to this color, I've converted many people to this color. Excellent coverage and it's 99 cents. The color is 511B and it is this beautiful, vibrant, bright pink, which I absolutely love. And then the best part is I just take a little bit off my lip and I give myself a little tiny bit right on the apple of my cheek, just for a little color. When you don't have blush, you make it work. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. We have so much fun making these videos and we wanna make more, so make sure you comment and tell us what you'd like to see next time. And if you like this video, like this video, and make sure you subscribe to Style Haul.